Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the Minecraft launcher is not working on Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to run Minecraft as an administrator. To do this just find your Minecraft executable and right click it and afterwards select the properties option. In here just click on the compatibility tab and afterwards make sure to check the box next to run this program as an administrator. Afterwards just click on apply and ok to save the changes and then you can check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to update your graphics card's driver. To do this right click the windows button and then select device manager from the list of options. In the device manager window make sure to expand display adapters and afterwards right click the problematic device and select the update driver option. Now you can click on search automatically for drivers and windows will try to find the best possible drivers for your PC. You can then check if the problem still persists. You can also delete the Minecraft Launcher profile file. To do this, press the Windows plus R key combo to open a run window and then type the following command. Now just press on Enter or OK to open that command. In here, just locate the .minecraft subfolder and double click it to open it and afterwards make sure to find the launcher profile.json, right click it and simply delete it. In the same folder you can delete the Minecraft mods, so if you have a mods folder just right click it and afterwards make sure to delete this as well. Now you can check if the problem still persists. And lastly another great solution is to reinstall Minecraft. To do this press the windows button and simply type appwiz.cpl and run this command from the search results. Personally I don't have Minecraft installed so I will show you a similar example. So find Minecraft in this list and afterwards click it and select the uninstall button. Lastly, just restart your PC and then reinstall Minecraft. You can then check if the problem still persists. And that's it. Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.